Karibu sana katika channel yetu ya Skills Bath Network learn more teach more. Mimi naitwa Jawad Maguru. Karibu sana. Tuendelee katika somo letu la leo ambalo lilopita tulikuwa tunazungumzia classification of any plant. Leo sasa tuone classification of moss plant. Karibu sana. Tunatumia kitabu chetu pendwa kabisa ambacho kimeandaliwa kwa ajili ya practical kama unavyokiona na biology practical. Na hiki ni kitabu kizuri sana. Nimesema nitakuandikia namba yangu hapo ili uweze kama unahisi unaweza kupata copy itakuwa ni vizuri sana utampatia mwanafunzi wako jambo la msingi sana. Twende moja kwa moja katika somo letu ambalo we are going to study classification of moss plant. We say this book is the answer for the questions asked within examinations. Let's go. Moss plant is the among of the specimen studied in biology practical and is found in our areas. Then we are going to see where it's found. It's going to be taken or is found. What is common name? You can say this moss you can call specimen S. The question is identify specimen S by common name. The common name of specimen S is moss plant. What is kingdom is kingdom is plantae. Phylum or division is bryophyta, bryophyta, b r y o f h y t a, bryophyta. What is observed features when you be provided with the, that specimen S within your table, within laboratories? What do you observe? One, you are supposed to have it has rhizoids, that is like roots. The second, it is small in size. That is feature. It has no true roots, stem, and the leaf like structure. Its leaf, its stem, and the leaf is not true like structure. It has a capsule. And at the last, it has a setter. That is the observable characteristics or observable features. What is the single characteristic of most plant to its phylum bryophyta? The single it has not true steam leaf and the, yes it has not true steam and leaf structure. It contains gametophyte and the sporophytes. Just make sure you understand we use it because this is a singular specimen and they are supposed to answer like this one eat 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 that note make sure you note that one it called the gametophyte is dominant is dominant while sporophyte live for a short period and remains attached to the gametophyte that is the characteristic which is distinguishing from other bryophytes. Characteristics of phylum bryophyte which most plant belongs. This is general characteristics. The member in this phylum it has the following characteristics. One, they are generally small in size. They have leaf, lake structure, called the thallus and the root like structure, called the rhizoid, but not true roots and the leaves. They lack vascular tissue, xylem and the phloem, phloem found in moist areas. They reproduce both sexually and asexually. That is characteristic of phylum, bryophyte. 
What is habitat of who? Moss plant. Terrestrial areas. Moist in areas. Near dams and the river. Mode of nutrition. Autotrophic mode of nutrition. Mode of reproduction. Most plants produce both sexually and asexually. What is respiratory organ of most plant? It is tomato. Question Why most plants do not grow taller? The answer is most do not grow taller because it has no vascular tissue, which is called xylem and the phloem. What is the advantage of most plant? Of most? Most help to decompose the low, dead logs. Most help to create a suitable environment for growth and the development of other plants. Most retain a lot of water. Thus, keep the, more, the soil moist. Reduce soil erosion. Prevent soil erosion, yes, by holding soil particles together. Provide shelter for insects and the other small animals. It is a source of food for other organisms, like fishermen who use this moss to capture the fish. Moss is used by birds, by some birds in the animal, are the nesting material. That is the advantage of moss plant. What is the disadvantage of moss? Most occur as a weed seed in garden and the other places. Most destroy the building walls. In our building walls, you can around your your house. Then you will see around the walls is a lake broken, uh, destroyed. That is it. Most advantage disadvantage. Most grow around the water bodies and the causing become mush. Water bodies become mush. That is it. This uh, advantage of moss. Thank you. That is the end of our classification of moss plant. Welcome again to see another classification of other specimen. Thank you.